carpenter hammer and rest it on him forehead and use the ball point hammer. Um, no man now will come out contact. So listen, you know, say, me I get beaten or me then. <laughs> Welcome back to our next video. So before I get into the video, please remember to like, subscribe, comment, share, tell a friend, if you tell a next friend, turn on your post notification bell so when I upload the videos, you can be notified. Guys, I just want to say a big thank you all to those who have been liking, subscribing, commenting. I truly appreciate it. So guys, before I get into the video, I want to tell you that I can't find my glasses. Yes. So I'm going to take you on the journey there with me. Figure show you my new glasses. But you don't see the title down below. What we are going to talk about. Because you don't know me I go down in the comment section. I talk to you. So guys, I was about to go on the road. And then I see this. And I'm like, no, I have to come and talk about this. Because you know, video of video. All right, and I'm here to speak on this and trust me if it was a situation where it was a man that did this to a woman Jamaica would be in an uproar right now but anyways I'm just gonna jump into what the news says and then I'm gonna let you hear a voice note and then we are gonna just talk about the situation the news is saying that um, a policeman was shot and in a reported domestic dispute in so some rest Manchester Monday evening he has been identified as constable D Blair who is stationed in the Manchester division the police wife is reportedly reportedly being admitted to hospital under police guard. Circumstances surrounding the incident are un still unclear, but observer online understand that the cop was shot during an incident with his wife. Police confirms the wife's wrist was observed slashed when she was taken into police custody and transferred to the hospital. It is not clear if the woman is a licensed firearm holder, but more details will be coming. So before the details come, I am gonna talk on it. And me just are gonna be real and I'm gonna say what is laid on my heart. And you no know, no, I know everything me I go look pan fleshy cause me no know if I because I lead that me have our me no me not try to look pan things fleshy and because I know who the Holy Spirit is in a child look and things fleshy. But there are some critical questions to this and and this is no way reason, shape, nor form giving this individual female the right to do what she have done. But some questions, some 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 things did if we talk. And then we are gonna make on hear the voice note. So before that, let me just say this. Is it that this woman was being abused? Was she the abuser? We have to think about the two questions. There. Was she being abused? Is she the abuser? Because enough times, whether you believe it or not, there are men in Jamaica that are going, and not the only Jamaica alone, all over the world, are going through domestic dispute with their partners and they are the abusers. The women are the ones that beat the men. Beat them. But because of the society that we live in, um... No man now will come out contact. So listen, you know, say, me I get beaten or me, they're not going to talk about it. So is it a case where this man was being abused? Was it a case where he was the one, he was the victim in this? And me no know. But anyways, listen to this voice note, guys. And when you listen to this voice note, then we are going to talk again. So hear this. Oh, man, I tell you, say, today I see the youth. You see it? And with the inform, the sub officer them say, he man left the lady, is it? When we get the call and hear the same drop out, the skate go up there, me and my bar them, you see? I will go up on the block, me and tell you, say, yo, you know the house is a mess. And the worst crime scene me ever go up on. You understand? 
Look like when Katy B is the man I left to fire some shot. You see it and catch him and the homeboy I try to take himself through the back door. You can see spar him hand and blood are run off him and run up on the wall and the door outside. And when the boy drop outside, you know the road, you know, the catty go over him, you know, and use the carpenter armor and rest it on him forehead and use the ball pint armor and beat out the head. You understand? Yeah, man, she did it in the fuck up. Yo. And then she just dropped the gun and the hammer on him somewhere around at the back of the yard. You understand? And she that try, I'm not gonna try, she cut her hand. I hope it's a she that bleed out. But you don't know as a police, well, not me though. The police, the first responder, them just, you know, bring her to the hospital. But may I tell you, I want the worst scene we ever go in. Go, 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 look, pan. No joke. Are the police dead in the street? Literally in the street. Is it? Car the car black off on the road. Car the man I try the man I try to run for no man you know. And drop and she just go over him and fuck him up. Yo, I tell you. All right. So on a hear that voice note and what the voice note is saying. Now, as I said before, I let you guys listen to the voice note. Is this man the abuser or is the woman the abuser? So let's say that the woman is and this is what costs the whole thing because listening to what this voice note is saying is basically allowing me to understand that this man was ready to leave the marriage he was ready to leave completely and this woman would not have it now in some situation you know say i saw some man stay when one woman ready for left they not have it is either before this Anna. I don't want to call the word because I don't want YouTube to torment my video. But you know what I'm saying. The D word before this Anna. So is it a case where this man was being physically, verbally abusive to the wife? Or the wife was being verbally and physically abusive to the to the, the, the husband and so the husband can't take it no more and maybe he's a husband that strongly believing me now will lift up my hand and hit a woman and so forth i rather to leave and maybe the woman realized that this man really know is going to leave and she just snap and to the gruesome way how this voice note sound this sound like some form of movie scene to know that you can shut a man that you walk down the aisle with your love, your care for, your cherish. You may not know how long they have been married, but you can't be able to do that. And then not only that, but the rage that is within you allows you to get a hammer and go over this man and do your head like that. Me not see no video, but I can just imagine. Me can just imagine looking on that scene right now through how the voice note is stated and structured me can just imagine there is no right to this any at all because whether you look both lives are lost because whether a man guilty or the woman guilty one gone and one ago prison the woman as they say they I, they can realize that her whatever was slashed maybe she was trying, as the voice note said, to go. So maybe me not allow you to left. We rather we go together. Maybe this was her intention, but the paramedics or whoever came managed to save her so she can be here to tell the tales. And I am waiting to hear what really happened. But in this day and age, as I said, in Jamaica, if this was a man that did this, there would be an uproar. I heard, I see a lot of comments where people are saying that, listen, this, um, a win is a win. And, um, finally, um, you know, a woman get to do this, a woman get to do that. I am not here to justify that because it is totally wrong. And we all have children. It could be somebody's, your son, it could be your daughter, whatever it is. This is where... You have to understand that we are living in a world where the devil is so rampant 
in seeking whom he may devour. And he plays on people's weaknesses so much that you can't even identify that this is the devil. You are going to say it is your mind. The devil is out there roaring so much that he's seeking so many people. He's there playing on people's heart, playing on people's mind, speaking to them that you think that it is not the devil. It is just I, I'm emotion or just something feel. And this is the enemy. Now, this is what I always say. You see, when something like this happens, I know that this woman will look back in herself and say, if me did know, and that is why we always say, if me did know, always come last. You never know. They say when you love a thing, you let it go, and if it is yours, it will come back. Many of us today, our mental health is so down there that we don't have the strength to fight and in our, and and because we don't have the strength to fight we turn to these things that soothe our in the moment reaction so it is in the moment i feel like me want to take something and just lick you me just i go take something and lick you we don't think about what is going to come after we just play in at the moment and see the now I don't know what transpired maybe this man has been going through some things long enough maybe this woman has been going through some things long enough you never know maybe the woman helped this man reach to a certain level in life and then he just get up and want walk out leave her and she's not gonna allow that she is nowhere shape or form right as I said to do what she have done trust me I'm telling you when I listen to this it, it, me don't know, me don't know, but trust me, it is very heartbroken. And two family in a loss right now, two family in a chaos and loss are hurt because one you now see them back again, the next one they will have to live with this. And if it is something that possesses this woman to do this, I know that this possession have left her and she's now left in sorrow and pain. And sorry that she did what she did. I was listening to a news where there was this young girl, I think she's a teenager, where she was telling her parents that she hears somebody talking in her head. Either her parents or her grandparents, one of them. And they were not taking it for anything. They never see it as anything wrong or nothing like that. So they just said, Cho. Maybe I was sick, she's sick, or she you know, feel well, or whatever. And lo and behold, they heard strange noise in her room. And when they hear strange noise in her room and go in there, she hanged herself. So I'm telling you guys that see this world and just believe, say, it just so, you know, just so. There are entities, there are forces out there that are walking to and fro this earth, looking for people who are open to enter into. Because me, I tell you, the Bible can't lie, they will come for kill, steal, and destroy. You know, come for come replenish, you know, come for come, come help, you know, come for come nothing more than bring destruction. And this is why I say you have to pray. You have got your bed. You have a partner you lie down next to. You have to pray. You have to cover yourself. Cover that person. Cover your household. Because you never know what. Listen. Job understand this, you know. And that is why Job would normally, um, when he, his children go out there and go do the little party and come back and whatever, Job wash his children off because he understand that there are entities out there there are forces that can attach their self to their to his children and come into his household and come take predominance in a house so he had to do these things to back off evil to drive away evil forces and in this day and age if we are not opening our eyes and to see what is going on in this world we are going to be totally lost and we are going to see people are getting good good people where we know we see them day by day going to work looking all right and i know that many of you on here can attest to this that you know people where you just see it and just take their life and you're wondering what happened what transpired they look so good yesterday they look so happy what happened what could have possibly make this person take his life or her life it's because of some forces that are operating that have entered into them so listen you will see one couple just like this now you may see a loving couple out there they are genuinely loving 
but one of them opened a door a door was open and so the enemy entered in you never know you wake up in the morning bam that one killed that one and you wonder say what happened that one there wonder how comes and on do it that is the real world that we're living in we're living in a spiritual world it is not a plaything it is very real i always say this to my people who are around me i know me say if god could allow our eyes to open and for us to see the things that we are walked to and fro up and road with would have dropped down dead because we yeah, I couldn't contain what we see we, we, we heart would have come out of our mouth it is just a sad situation and you can definitely see this would come in like the Russian situation with the children for you to know that you 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 stab a person so many times just to feel satisfied that the hunger of that demon within that person for blood that in literally want to see that this work is complete it is finished so me now stop until he is breathless this is literally what looked like it happened to me it is so sad and it is a sad situation and i don't have words i just me just come fit up about it and let us open our eyes and please when you know go out on the road and you know go on a bed without no partner when you could have dead together for 50 years pray over them pray over yourself ask god to cover you know build a fence around on a bed put a pillar of fire around on a bed because when the enemy coming like a run run come to seek who he may devour comfy can sow this card in your partner ears in your ears you can be strong enough to withstand these things when they when he come because trust me if you are not strong you are going to fall and then many times you're gonna say this can't happen to me that can't happen to me this can't happen to me you have to build up yourself so guys this is sincerely a sad situation but we just have to pray and keep covering ourselves please remember to like subscribe comment and share turn on your post notification bell so when i upload a video you can be notified love you guys Mwah.